and welcome to uh, this channel. Today we're going to make marinade, uh, chicken marinade, uh, using five ingredients and here are the ingredients. So we have uh, this is garlic and a bit of ginger paste, um, some fresh rosemary, uh, some vinegar, uh, some oil, and dark soy sauce so let's get started so i'll start off with chopping the rosemary and then we do the marinade it's good have my bowl here with me so let's start so i'm going to start with adding my rosemary in there these are fresh make sure your rosemary is fresh you can even use dried ones if you have them yes uh, rosemary and then i'm going to add soy sauce here is my soy sauce i'm going to add one tablespoon of soy sauce. Uh, I'm going to also add one tablespoon of oil. Let's add a kidogo. Kidogo, kidogo, a little bit more. I will add the garlic and ginger powder right there, and a little bit of vinegar. So, basically, what you need for your evening marinade. You need an acid, an oil, uh, some seasoning or herbs, and uh, something salty or sweet. So that can be honey or uh, soy sauce. So I'm going to mix all this. So we're not adding salt because when you add salt, uh, it tends to draw out the juices in the meat. So I'll be adding the salt when I'll be cooking. Yeah, so there is my marinade, guys. Look at that. Yeah. So I'm going to add my marinade to my chicken. going to mix all this together you can use your hands but I prefer not to so yeah get it all in there Look at that guys, look at that, looks so yummy already, yeah, just to cover this with a clean film or you can use a zipper lock bag. So for me I'm going to use this zip lock bag, so I'm going to add my chicken in here, my hands are clean. So I'll add this in here. It looks so yummy. Yummy, yummy. Yummy in the time. Yes, guys. So, yeah, put everything that's left in the bowl in there. Yes, baby.
here and then I'm going to wash my hands and come back. So here is my chicken in the zipper lock back. Yes. So I'm going to remove any excess air inside the bag and then lock the chicken in. Remember guys, when you're marinating anything after you mix your marinade, make sure you taste it before you add it to your meat so that you can be sure the ingredients are all balanced. So let's get this to the fridge for a few minutes, maybe an hour maximum and then we'll get to cook this. I'm trying to make sure I don't stain my fridge, so I'm wiping off the excess money that might be outside the zip bag. Right, so let's get this to the fridge. So I don't know if I'm the only one. You see how this fridge immature up uh, the meat? If I put my meat here, it usually goes bad after like two days. So I prefer putting my uh, meat in the freezer. So yeah, I don't put it here. But when I'm marinating, I usually put it here because it's for a few hours. <laughs> 